floor expert from the start they are very well versed in terms of their knowledge and also they have a very nice pleasant showroom for us to bring our clients over to visualize the materials <music> Hi, I'm Jing Long. I'm a senior interior designer in Forefront. I've been working in this industry for five years. Back then, I was studying in LaSalle College of the Arts, holding a bachelor degree in interior design. So for our company Ethos, is we always cross collab and be more open for ideas to find the best solution for our clients as well. Personally for me, mine is located at Luoyang. It's a two-bedder resale condo. This concept was more towards Singapore colonial design. This client has uh, shared a few more images that we saw a lot of uh, architectural elements very closely related to those colonial design. So we kept that as a design starter. And along the way, I think we, we still have a conversation around like saying that she, she collects a lot of art pieces, display. So we dive into what are the things that she's gonna keep because she's uh, previously from a three-bedder to a two-bedder. So how could we you know, declutter and make all the art pieces more stand out in a good manner? And also, I found that she liked a lot of pops of colour, but we want to keep it subtle because we don't want it to be too overwhelming for the whole space. But rather, we feel that the art pieces should be a conversation starter when the guest comes over and you know, each either pocket spaces has an interesting spot for them. So for myself, I think what I've done is I keep the, the base of the wall very simple, just plain white walls, floorings a little bit more uh, fun. We have a little bit of terrazzo floorings. Uh, to give a pop of colour. Then the rest, I think, is more of uh, her stuff to stand out as a showcase piece. I would say we don't have a very, very distinct design concept, but more importantly, I think the principle, we are more towards uh, minimalism. In Singapore context, we are all living a very uh, compact housing and there's a lot of clutter. I believe everyone wants to come back to a home where, where it's more bright and airy, cozy, just warm lightings and just chill. I think that that principle itself has been applied for us in the whole uh, layout and design. Of course, I, I, I wouldn't disagree that there's a lot of uh, other design that interests us, like uh, maybe eclectic, uh, colonial. We will draw all the influence, like for instance, the materials, the certain guidelines, like uh, the furniture, uh, with the influence of minimalism. First and foremost is uh, the knowledge of their product. So they have to understand where do their material made from and how is it being made. I think these are very important things that I believe uh, most of our clients or even us as designers are very curious about. Second thing is the quality. Where is it made from? The whole company's uh, reputation and also the execution on the ground side. Uh, are they able to upkeep with the qualities? Is there any issues will they be able to face up front? Okay, so for their new launch product, I think uh, it's laminated flooring that I think there's a few elements that they have introduced. One is the seashell kind of patterns. The other one is a flower, flower incorporated into the laminated floorings. The other one is more carpet feel. So I think these are all very interesting finishes that I think clients are actually uh, looking at. Carpet one like, could be uh, better incorporated into maybe a bedroom space or living space to soften out the whole mood and feel. Flowers uh, in, onto the laminated floorings are also uh, always nice. It injects more colours and also the uh, softness of the whole space as well. Clients are always keen on what's the latest product, so I think they, they definitely upkeep what, all this uh, trend that, uh, that is coming up. And I think these are places and materials that we are definitely more keen on to explore how we could better apply it. So the flower one, they'll be like, wow, how, how could they do that? That kind of thing. So we explain to them how, how is it work and also they understanding the practical portion really, they also like, uh, actually, I don't mind trying to have this maybe for my, my living room. So it could be a design driven starter as well. I think responsible and responsive. Floor experts from the start, they are very well versed in terms of their knowledge and also they have a very nice, pleasant showroom for us to bring our clients over to visualize the materials. They conduct a lot of trainings for us to be more aware and more informed. It was an eye-opener, I must say, during the training. So I think uh, Alan, the managing director, has shared with us the, the, the knowledge of what their, their materials are. Collectively, they also come up with new products, so we are more pushing the boundaries from there on. When it comes to uh, on-site, they are very responsible in a sense. They have a certain protocol. Before installation, they will usually do a site survey, ensure that the grounds are uh, suitable before installing. 
So I think that was something we value the most. And when it comes to installation and solutions, they are always there for us, giving us the best solution even before and after installation. So during COVID period, I think I believe there's a lot of uh, shortage of manpower. But however, I think they, they are very responsive and work closely with us and telling us the, the timeline and all. I think so far our projects during that period of time, the timeline wasn't being compromised at all. I think the effort that they make is very, uh, they do constant updates with us to ensure that we don't compromise in terms of the design and also the, the installation process. The one that is managing our company is Priscilla, so she has been very on the ball when it comes to the reserving of the vinyls, ensuring that uh, we are always on time and no stops are all on my site supervision is also there. We are very comfortable with her and also we hope that this will be uh, working in a very, very long run. Yeah. Flooring, I think, is something that is more of the main part of the purchase in terms of renovation. So I think quality is something uh, we value most and it shouldn't be compromised at all. The material that they use are all made from Belgium, so we are quite uh, certain. And they do a lot of testing and certification to, to ensure clients are more assured of their product. The service and experience overall at Floor Expert is definitely excellent and also uh, very pleasant. They are always there for us from the start to the end, before installation to after installation and the after sales service, they are always very responsive. Small little things that um, maybe homeowners don't, don't realize, but for us, we really value and cherish this with our flooring partners, which is Floor Experts. Floor Expert definitely met I think a cut above uh, our expectation and I feel that uh, we are actually recommending it to a few of our ID firms that we know and even for our family and friends and even my relatives I also uh, have been using their product because I believe in it so I dare to recommend their product. Uh, it's really legit. <laughs>